BigQuery is a fully managed data warehouse that provides incredibly fast SQL analytics over large datasets. BigQuery provides more than 100 datasets publicly available to analyze, covering a variety of data types from historical weather to taxi trips taken in New York City. We try to offer utility datasets such as the US Census data so that customers can join these data without needing to import them. While these datasets are being used in vital decision making across enterprises, they are also a great place to get started with analyzing data in BigQuery. Get started by navigating to the Google Cloud Console at console.cloud.google.com. If you are new to Google Cloud and BigQuery, use the video linked in the description below to set up a new project in the BigQuery sandbox. No credit card is required. Open the navigation window and select Marketplace. In the left-hand menu, click to filter by datasets. Each tile represents a public dataset. For example, the American Community Survey is an ongoing survey that collects social, economic, housing, and demographic data by surveying more than 3.5 million U.S. households annually. In addition to being used in governmental funding decisions, private businesses also find this data useful in their own strategic decision making. Clicking on the tile will provide you more detail on the dataset, including a description of the dataset, sample queries, and metadata showing information such as when the dataset was last updated, and if there's a regular update frequency. To access the dataset, click the View Dataset button. This opens a new console window and brings you to the dataset in the BigQuery web UI. You can see each of the tables available within the dataset. In fact, you can scroll through the other public datasets in the program here as well. Back to the ACS dataset. Click on a table, and you will see the schema, or columns, available in that table, along with the table details, including the size and number of rows, and a preview of the first few rows of data. Click Query Table, and a template will appear in the Query Editor, which already references the selected table. If you'd rather start with one of the sample queries, you can also click the Run This Query button from the Details page you were looking at earlier. Let's look at this one. How has King County rent cost as a share of median income changed between 2011 and 2017? In the Query Editor, click Run, and in just a few seconds, you have a table showing how the rent, as a percentage of median income, has changed for each zip code in the county. Looking to analyze data without writing SQL? Just highlight the table you wish to analyze in the left-hand nav, Click Export and choose Explore in Data Studio, Google's data visualization tool. BigQuery charges for storage and offers pay-as-you-go, on-demand pricing, or flat rate pricing for predictability when querying data. You can also take advantage of the free tier option to quickly get started. Use the BigQuery Sandbox to stay safely within the free tier. More info on how to get started in the BigQuery Sandbox linked in the description below. Happy analyzing!